the requests of Bihar government for external assistance from multilateral development banks will be expedited. Andhra Pradesh Reorganization Act. Our government has made concerted efforts to fulfill the commitments in Andhra Pradesh Reorganization Act. Reorg recognizing, recognizing the state's need for the capital, recognizing, a, recognizing the state's need for a capital, we will facilitate fi special financial support through multilateral development agencies. In the current financial year, 15,000 crore rupees will be arranged with additional amounts in future years. Our government is fully committed to financing and early completion of the Polavaram Irrigation Project which is the lifeline which is the lifeline for Andhra Pradesh and its farmers this will facilitate our country's food security as well under the act under the act Andhra Pradesh reorganization act for promoting industrial development funds will be provided for essential infrastructure such as water, power, railways, and roads in Koparthi Node on the Vishagapatnam Chennai Industrial Corridor and Varavakal Node on the Hyderabad Bangalore Industrial Corridor. An additional allocation will be provided this year towards capital investment for economic growth. Grants for backward regions of Rayalaseema, Prakasham, North Coastal Andhra, as stated in the Act, will be provided. PM Awas Yojana. Three crore additional houses under the PM Awas Yojana in rural and urban areas in the country have been announced for which the necessary allocations are being made. Women-led development. For promoting women-led development, the budget carries an allocation of more than 3 lakh crore for schemes benefiting women and girls. The signals, this signals our government's commitment for enhancing women's role in economic development. Pradhan Mantri Janjatiya Unnat Gram Abhiyan. For improving the socio-economic condition of tribal communities, we will launch the Pradhan Mantri Janjatiya Unnat Gram Abhiyan by adopting saturation coverage for tribal families in tribal majority villages and aspirational districts. This will cover 63,000 villages benefiting 5 crore tribal people. Bank branches in northeastern region. More than 100 branches of India Post Payment Bank will be set up in the northeast region to expand the banking services. This year, I have made a provision of 2.66 lakh crore rupees for rural development, including rural infrastructure. Priority four, manufacturing and services, support for promotion of MSMEs. This budget provides special attention to MSMEs and manufacturing, particularly labor intensive manufacturing. We have formulated a package covering financing regulatory changes and technology support for MSMEs to help them grow and also compete globally as mentioned in the interim budget.
I am happy to announce the following specific measures. Credit guarantee scheme for MSMEs in the manufacturing sector.